Here's a low nose tech quick review under two minutes, hopefully. This is your Jovel 1080p Full HD Versatile Smart Projector. You can connect Bluetooth speakers or headphones, mirror your smart devices, and connect it to Wi-Fi. More on that later. In the box, you'll find your Jovel projector, power cord, and a remote. On the top of the projector, you have your control buttons, power on and off, menu button, return button, and arrow keys to navigate through the OS. On the bottom, you'll see your speaker, dust filter, height adjustment screws, and a quarter inch screw hole for the ceiling or a tripod. Me, I'll be using a tripod for this video. On the back, your IO ports. VGA, a USB port for USB sticks with media on it and powering streaming dongle devices. Two HDMI ports, AV input, audio output for external speakers, and auxiliary sound holes. On the side, you got your power port, cooling vents, and a manual keystone correction knob. Last in the front, your lens and a manual focus knob. Now, find a flat area for your projector, then turn it on. Now, I have to say this from the start. For the best picture quality possible, you want to keep this line perpendicular with the screen as much as possible. The keystone helps, but very slightly. For picture quality, I plugged in a streaming dongle into HDMI 1 and enjoyed some content. The 1080p image that comes out is nice. But like I said before, you want to make sure that this is flat and level to get the best focus. Obviously, with a budget projector like this, you want a room that is dark as possible so you can get the richest colors. And to be honest, I wouldn't try to go too big with this projector. While it does deliver a good image with solid colors, it starts getting washed out very noticeably the farther you get away. It says it can do 150 inches, but honestly for me, I wouldn't go past 80 inches. But that's just me. As far as gaming, it works, nothing amazing, but for sure you will have fun playing this on a big screen. You can also mirror Android and iOS devices. Now, this really depends on the device you're using and its restrictions when mirroring apps. With an iPhone, you can mirror basic things, but the top apps like Netflix, HBO Max, and Disney, it doesn't go through. Another thing about the mirroring mode, I found it to be buggy at times, where all of a sudden it would lose connection and struggle to reconnect. Now, let's talk about the speakers, and the speakers can get loud. But the sound quality is what you expect from a projector at this range. Don't forget, you can upgrade your sound by connecting a Bluetooth speaker or external speakers. Overall, the Jovel 1080p Full HD Smart Projector will satisfy your immediate projector needs. While it does give you a good, vibrant picture, it's not really bright enough to hold up in an ambient lit area, or if you try to make the screen too big. As long as you keep this on a flat surface and take the time to get the picture just right along with the focus, you will definitely enjoy this for an occasional movie night. Okay, hope this video helped you out. Enjoy. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like, and ring that bell. See you in the next one. Bye.